Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the nearby nation, welcome back to another exciting episode, and hopefully this will be an exciting episode of Divine RPG, in which I'm in creative mode. Awesome. Uh, so the reason why I'm in creative mode, by the way, is because I had died from hunger, and now I flew back down to the first level again, so we can try this all over again. That's a Minecraft bug, by the way. It's not anything... I mean, I had to do it, so... There's that right there. We're just going to keep getting some of these things from these guys. Awesome, right? But these are not what we're needing. We actually need, and there's some more. Wow, we got a lot of these guys. Okay, we need to kill some mobs with our bare fist because that's all we have right now. So, uh, there are some mobs. There were some over here just a second ago. Some shadars or whatever they're called. Shadar somethings. Uh, there's a bumblebee looking thing that's coming after me. I really don't like this one. This one is horrible. But, uh, yeah, we just got to kill these guys to get the dirty pearls, right? And then what we got to do with the dirty pearls is, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. We got to trade the dirty pearls with, uh, the guys up the level above us, which we're going to have to get to that level by digging, right? And, uh, they will turn the dirty pearls into moles, molds, <laughs> not moles, molds. Apparently these guys don't move. Well, I'm liking that. Are they stuck in place? They must be bugged or glitched or something because they are stuck in place. Their feet are just like moving like crazy. But they're not moving. I'm happy with that. Except for I'm hungry now. And I might die of hunger again. Because these guys don't drop anything you can eat. Look at that. Look how fast my hunger bar is going down from just trying to hit these guys. I don't really like this. See, I'm almost hungry again. I'm almost dead from hunger again. I should not have died from hunger. Why did I die from hunger? You know what? We're going to turn this on easy mode so that way I don't die from hunger. That'll save us the uh, whole worriness of that. I know I'm switching down to easy, but hey, I don't want to die from hunger right now. This world does not present itself with a lot of food. And all we want is dirty pearls. Alright, we should be able to get 12 dirty pearls out of this. 11 dirty pearls, my bad. Ow, did he hit me? Oh no, it's hunger. So go down halfway. I'm happy with that. We're going to use these to build up with because they're light blocks, so they're really cool. And then how long does it take to dig? Okay, so dirt's not going to... Actually, dirt might be faster to dig. We're just going to need this to dig up to get to the next level because we need to find something called the hunger. So here is an awesome com comment by Jordan. 27419 says nearby trade your pearl molds and swords for s molds and swords and other weapons you put them in the altar with a type of lump which determines how much damage it does hope this helps so here's the lumps but you need to trade the pearls to get the uh, but you need to trade them with uh, something called the hunger and I'm not exactly sure what level they're at uh, let's see to get the weapons you have to trade for templates with the hunger Let's see if I can easily look up where the hunger is at. Hunger. I'm on the wiki right now. The Hunger is an NPC trader that spawns in the Vithia. It has 1,000 health, and despite its threatening appearance, uh, let's see, they generally spawn all over. Find them; they should not be difficult. So they're threatening looking and they spawn all over. So apparently I don't need to worry. Those aren't the hunger, are they? Those are dream wreckers. I don't want to wreck my dreams right now. They spawn all over, it says. So it doesn't say that I have to go to a certain biome or anything. Let's see what they look like. They look like, okay, little things that stand on the ground that have like three sides sticking out of them. So they don't look like regular NPCs. So that's cool. Uh, whoa, what are you doing up there, guy? Oh, it's going to take forever. He can stay up there. 
Whoa. There's more of Dream Wreckers. I really don't want my dreams wrecked right about now. It says they spawn all over the place. And you trade pearls to get carrots, cakes, um, all kinds of stuff. Disc templates, molds, all kinds of stuff. What's those guys? Those are toxic. I really don't like those. Don't they come after me? I think they do. And they're invisible. There's some more right there. We'll stay as far away from those guys as we can. Come over here. We'll go ahead and kill more a couple of these things since they don't move and they're glitched out for some reason. Ow. Ow. Never mind. There's a bee on me. If I die again, I'm going to be so angry. I think I am going to die again because I'm down to one bar. I really need to find the hunger because then I can get some food. And that's what I need right now. I need food. So they should be on the first level, you would think. The hunger. We're just going to have to walk around to see if we can find them. There's another pearl. Nice. More of these guys. Watch the hunger be like the only thing that doesn't spawn in this world. More Shadar. Is that the hunger? Acid hag? Acid hag. I don't really want to. Let's go over here and kill these guys. You might say it's cheating. I say it's being smart about it and not dying. So there's that. Uh, let's go back to our comments. I know I need templates and armor. Thank you, Michael Sumner, now. I just gotta get the templates and armor. Creepers are beasts. Says those things are mob spawn era, era, areas maybe. There we go. Killed him. More shad air, shad R, whatever you want to call them. There's a lot of these guys. I might as well just go ahead and kill them because we're gonna need the pearls regardless. And if I find a hunger, I don't want to have to only get one thing. <laughs> they're so cute. Running like they're crazy. I might find the hunger on the uh, top level when I die. If I die, that is. If. scroll down see this guy's just stuck in place puzzle master says in Vithia you generate into fusion tables first you need corresponding lumps such as teaker and once you have corresponding lumps you will need a template which you can trade from the hunger once you have a template lump place them in the correct slot oh no these guys I hate I hate these guys oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh mmm is that another slug looking thing? Are they still following me? Kind of. I'm sorry it's so dark guys. Not much I can do about that. I have some lights. Four. But then I have bees chasing me. Wow. The dream wreckers are just setting up there. Waiting to wreck people's dreams. See that's cool. Whatever that is. That building up there. I should probably see if I can get up to that. Because that looks pretty darn cool and nifty. Let's see. Really? It was still following me? Oh, it's got to be raining too. It's just... Oh, no! Here I am dying again. Oh, wow. My life, my life, so beautiful. Oh, the dirt gets harder after you keep going down? That's not good. How many layers till I reach the uh, death floor? I really don't want to have to dig this way and then dig down, but I might as well to protect myself, my life. 
Uh, Puzzle Master says the uh, hunger is NPC traded found in the first layer near the ceiling uh, Vithia village. Ceiling. Vi so I was there, wasn't I? I was there. There was the ceiling village. You'll take dirty pearls, clean pearls, polished pearls, and shiny pearls for food, weapons, and armor templates. Hmm. So I was all the way down there. Wherever I died was where I was I need to be. You know what guys? I'm gonna die when I fall anyways, so one two three. Alright, we reached the floor that we need to be on. I just need to go to my death point now. Latest death. It's all the way over here. Oh there's there's some more. Sweet. Awesome. That's what we need to be on. Oh, I'm still in creative mode. My bad. I keep forgetting. Fixed. Alright. Like I said, that's something that's going to happen no matter what. So, you might say I'm cheating by doing that, but not really. Alright. That's the ceiling village, I think. So, let's get these 25 blocks that I have right here. Let's carry those as well. I wonder if I could... I know it's technically cheating, but I can. Okay, <laughs> never mind. I'll uh, just I'll stop doing that. <laughs> it's a, it's a good hack. Okay, it's a good hack. All right. Is this the inside? Probably not. I wish they wouldn't make the block so hard to to destroy okay there's some light in there so that's good apparently this is the village if there's any enemies that's gonna kill me I would really not like to see them oh really this one has nothing in it okay we'll go to the next one We'll just make a bridge across. Oops, wrong kind, of, wrong type of bridge. There we go. Let's see what we can find over here. Hunger, where art thou? Hmm. That's definitely not the hunger. So let's come back out here. Alright, so there's something over there. Let's go ahead and go up one and go over. It's a lot of work to break these blocks. I swear this looks like a village up in the sky. That broke really easily. Must be some sort of glass. Whoa! Ow. Okay. I bet it's right there. Let's get some more dirt so we can go up. We'll just break the glass from underneath. Hopefully I don't make him drop and he dies. That would be horrible. Those guys are just staring at me like minions. Yes, master. Alright, we'll go up. Up some more. Till we reach the top. Break some glass. Hello? Is anyone home? No one's home. Really? No one at all is home. Maybe it was... There's one this way that looks weird on my screen, on my map. Maybe he's in here.
Hunger, are you in here? Hunger? No. He's not. He's not in here. Anywhere. I don't know where he could be. I did that on purpose, by the way. So I think I've checked in every single one of these. Maybe this one. I don't think I checked in this one. It's a pretty solid big base. Let's go ahead and get some more dirt and dig up to this one. Last one to check. Nearby the villagers is where the hunger spawns. It looks creepy, but it's peaceful. The villages are floating houses. You can trade for templates with them. If this is it, if this is what I look I'm looking at right now, the floating houses then. Which it doesn't even look like a house, by the way. Design needs to be upped a little bit. Right. Anyone in here? Anyone? No. No one's in here. Obviously not those. Or unless I just chose the wrong floating houses. Could be though. Floating greenhouses. Hunger's on top. I looked inside all of those houses. Is there something I'm doing wrong here? That one. I haven't looked inside that one. Let's go to this one. Maybe, just maybe. Cross your fingers. I just might be the most unluckiest LPer in the world. I think that's what it is, guys. I really do. Up, 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 and away. Hunger. Hunger. Nothing. Is that a tree inside of that one? I don't think I've been inside of that one because I don't remember seeing a tree. Yeah, there's a tree inside of it, but still nothing. I use this one to cross over. So, you guys tell me. In the next episode, we'll figure out if we need to find more of these. Tell me down in the comment section below if you think that uh, I was just very unlucky and no hunger decided to spawn inside of these buildings. Thanks for watching. As always, guys, don't forget to leave a like. 250 likes equals a extra episode a day, so you guys can do that. I know you can. And, uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next episode. Hopefully, we can find the hunger. Bye, everyone.